Hey friends, welcome to today's video. Today I have a good old fashioned haul. I went shopping at Blue Mercury for their holiday sale event. It's happening right now and it goes through December 4th and you basically can save up to 20% off depending on how much you spend. I'll have all the details for the sale down below. The code is GIFT. So you save 20% off when you spend 250 or more. You save 15% off when you spend 175 or more. And then you save 10% when you spend $100 or more. So I went and I took full advantage and I just loaded up. <laughs> I got some of my like holy grail products that I've used for probably a decade. And then I picked up some new products as well. And then I also wanted to share with you a little curated collection of products you can pick up from Blue Mercury during their sale that I highly recommend. This video is in partnership with Blue Mercury. Blue Mercury is a beautiful, beautiful boutique makeup beauty shopping destination. I was so excited when they came into Austin a few years ago. The first Blue Mercury store that I ever visited was in New York City, maybe, I don't know, six or seven years ago. And I hadn't been in one before and I kind of stumbled in it. It was next to a hotel. And I'll never forget walking in, not knowing, like I hadn't heard of it before. And I walked in really not knowing what to expect. And I was like, <gasps> like cue the like birds and the lights and the clouds parting and the angelic music. I was just like, this is beautiful. It's such a beautiful, beautiful store. And it really is boutique shopping kind of at a whole nother level. You can shop and get all the brands that you know and love. Hourglass, Bobbi Brown, Chantecai, Jane Aradell, Dyson, Orbay. I mean, you name it and they have it, but they also have the best I mean, the best knowledgeable, like personal associates that work in their store. They truly are just like exceptional. They are super knowledgeable about anything. You could ask about a random product on the shelf and they'll be able to give you like all the train. It's, it's almost like they're, they're brand experts, but they represent all the brands in the store. They're just so great. And the customer service is at a whole nother level. I shop here in Westlake and I have the best guy that works in my store. His name's Caden and he is so great. He's not only super knowledgeable and helpful, but he gives me like honest personal recommendations. I might ask him about a product and he'd be like, you know what? I think this product would be better for you than this. And I was ready to buy that product. So I just really, really trust them so, so much. And then he also follows up to let me know about sales and promotions that are happening in the store. So I just feel it's just a very personal experience that I really appreciate in today's day of customer service. Okay, you guys, there's my love and affection for Blue Mercury. Let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna share what I picked up first and then I'll go into my recommendations. That sound fair? And several things I picked up will be recommendations because like I said, I've been using them for a long time. So, okay, first and foremost, let's start with a few products from Loon and Aster. Loon and Aster is Blue Mercury's in-house cosmetic brand. I have purchased several of their products in the past, but these are new products. And I believe that they're actually new releases as well. So I walked by and I saw this 12 pan eyeshadow palette. And yes, it's pretty basic. Yes, it's pretty neutral. Yes, I probably have four or five, six palettes similar to it, but I loved the presentation and I loved how these shades were all laid out. It really has every shade that you need. It was a palette that I knew I would use. It was something I knew I could keep here on my vanity and whether I wear this by itself or I pick and grab colors to play with other palettes or other shades, I knew it was gonna be a very practical and useful palette. I also think it is really great for traveling. You know, I like mini palettes when I travel, but sometimes when you're traveling, you wanna have more makeup options, but you don't wanna pack other palettes. So this is really great for when you're traveling, you wanna have like a full variety of like really natural basic looks, or if you wanna glam it up, you can also in this palette. I thought it was really beautiful. I actually created the look that I have on with this palette and another shade that I'm gonna share with you shortly. So I'm excited. I'm heading to Costa Rica in a few weeks and this is definitely coming with me. Okay, so let's move on to what else I have on my eyes because I'm really excited about this. I walked by the display when I was shopping and I was like, <gasps> when I swatched these, I was like, these are amazing. I have to have them. Can I buy all of them? No, okay, I have to pick two. So I picked these two. These are the Stardust Eye Pop from Luna Naster. I have the shade Smoky Topaz here. I'll show you what that looks like. And then I have the shade Rose Quartz here. Let me show you what that looks like. So pretty. So these are a cream to powder formula. They are extremely metallic, very foiled. They are heavier. They're not a sheer, like, you know, a very sheer shimmery shadow, like a topper. These are like very, very opaque. I have this layered on my eyelid in the inner corner and I used Rose Quartz and I just used my finger to apply it. And you guys, super pigmented, very metallic. It definitely feels like a cream 
that dries to a powder. When I first opened these and played with them, I didn't do a whole lot of research or know what formula they were. I thought they were just a straight up powder, but then I played with it and I was like, wait a minute, this is like a cream, right? And I looked it up and it's a cream to powder. So what's great about it being to a cream to powder is you're not gonna have a whole lot of fallout that you will have with more shimmery foiled shadows like this. So these are beautiful, especially for holiday, gorgeous, gorgeous, easy to apply. You can throw these on any eyeshadow look and really just take it up a notch. So really happy that I purchased these. I also picked up a Loon and Aster gel eyeliner. And this was because Caden recommended this to me. He knows that I love the Trish, of course he knows, the Trish McAvoy gel eyeliner. You guys know that I talk about it all the time here on YouTube. I love that pencil because it's very rich and soft and it's great for tight lining. And he said that this was very similar to that. And he was right. I picked up the shade brown, very creamy, very comfortable, definitely a nice little dupe for the Trish McAvoy. So I've really been into masking lately and I always love going to Blue Mercury because they have a whole little uh, like masking bar in the back of my store. It's like a whole display set up for masking. And it's just so fun to like look at all the different masks and what they do. And just, I don't know, it's fun to try new things. So I actually picked up five of these. These are from Patchology. This is the Hydrate Mask. It comes with one, it has a hyaluronic acid, vitamin B5, vitamin, yeah, vitamin B5. I was gonna read this, but it's just the same thing in another language. <laughs> it's a five minute sheet mask. I picked up six of these because I'm headed to Costa Rica in a few weeks. I'm putting together a little gift bags. And so each of my guests is gonna get a one of these in their gift bag. So I haven't used these yet. I will keep you posted. I have tried other masks from Petrology and I like them. I've tried some eye masks that I picked up at the last Blue Mercury event. So I'm really excited to play with these. Okay. Now now this I'm so excited about. I finally did it, you guys. I finally picked her up. I always do this. When hot new releases come out, I always hesitate and then I wait like a month and then I end up buying it and getting it. So this is by Hourglass. This is their new ambient light edit unlocked, the elephant. I believe this is medium. They have like a light, a dark or a light, medium and dark, I think. And is this the light one or is this the medium? Anyway, it has six powders. You get a finishing powder in dim light, a finishing powder in soft light, a metallic strobe powder in beaming strobe light, a bronzer, a blush in iridescent coral, and a blush in radiant rose. I love hourglass powders. I think they are some of the best for a nice, natural, radiant, like lit look to the skin. They really are truly unique and very, very special. When you are going for that look to have radiant skin with without looking shiny or like oily or like dewy, this will achieve that look. It just gives you that look like, a, like you're walking around with a light shining on your face. The light reflects off these really refined shimmer particles in all the powders, whether it's the bronzer, the setting powder, or the blush, and it just gives you like gorgeous glowy skin. So I think this is a beautiful, beautiful palette and formula for especially those of us that have texture on our skin, maybe pores or fine lines, or wrinkles, and we have to avoid really like shimmery highlighters because those can magnify. This is so stunning and beautiful and very special, and I treasure this. I treasure this. I know that sounds dramatic for makeup products, but I. I am really, really excited to have this. Okay, you guys, so I stocked up on my Orbe. Now, <laughs> it always, anytime I have to purchase these, which isn't very often because they last forever, but anytime I do, it's like a little bit of a, you know, brace yourself because it's the Jumbo Jumbo Orbe shampoo and conditioner. These are a pretty penny. It is Orbe, it is what it is, I know. And I know some people are gonna think that I'm crazy for spending this much on shampoo and conditioner. I get it, and I don't really have a, an argument. I can just say that I love this and I really, and this lasts me forever. I wash my hair maybe three times a week, three times a week. Sometimes I can get away with two, but I probably shouldn't admit that. So I don't wash my hair very often. So these will last me six, seven, I don't know. They just last forever. I rarely purchase these. And when I do, I am always waiting for an event like this, an event where I can save a lot of money. So I grabbed the Jumbo Signature Conditioner and Signature Shampoo. I'll switch between this and the Gold Lust. Currently I'm finishing up the Gold Lust and I have them both in these sizes as well. I love it. I know it's crazy, but I love it. I, what can I say? It is what it is, you guys. <laughs> I love it so much that I actually purchased a travel size for Costa Rica. Same thing, signature shampoo, signature conditioner, just in the travel size. So this would be a great way to try it to see if I'm right or to see if you think I'm crazy, but <laughs> they, they sell travel sizes. I also picked up a product that my hairstylist has used on me before, but I've never purchased it. It's the Orbe Gold Less Nourishing Hair Oil. I have other hair oils that I enjoy, but I've really been wanting this for a long time. 
time and I just decided to treat myself. The way that she uses this most of the time when she styles my hair, it's a very lightweight oil. It smells incredible. Like literally, oh, I hate to even waste a drop. My hair is very dirty today, so I don't wanna put any more product in it, but I'm just gonna do a tiny little drop. Oh, it's, or, but there you just can't compare the scent of Orbe. Oh, it's intoxicating, it really is. It's a very lightweight oil. She'll put this on my hair after she styles it and it just gives the most beautiful shine. It's also super lightweight, so it's great for someone like me that tries to go as long as she can without washing her hair because it's not gonna like build up and make my hair heavier or, or more oily. Also, my hairstylist said that it'll work really well at night. If I wanna put it in my hair at night before I go to bed, when I wake up in the morning, it's all absorbed, so I don't have that oily like feel to the hair, but it's like super luxe and shiny, so I grabbed this. And that is everything that I picked up. Now, let me share a couple more recommendations for you for the sale. I don't want them to go unmentioned because they're very, very great products. So Blue Mercury also has a skincare brand in house. It's called M61 and their Power Glow Peel Pads are just phenomenal. I have the original, like this is just the original and then this has a gradual tan to it. I use them both and I like them. This gives pretty instant results. If you use this at night, the next morning you will wake up and you will see a tan to your face. It's very natural. I don't use these every single night because I don't wanna get that built up with a tan. I'll use these, if I'm trying to maintain that tan on my skin, I'll use these maybe maybe three times a week. And I actually don't use these every night either. I kind of like gauge to how my skin feels. So the way that you use this is after you clean your skin at night, you take this and you kind of rub it all over the face, on the neck, also on the chest, and it's an exfoliating. It has glycolic, salicylic acid, vitamin K, bilberry, and chamomile. So it's a very gentle exfoliating peel pad, but I really, really love these. It comes in a little box, you get a ton of them, and I always have them stocked up in my little drawer by my bathroom. I've got two little mini palettes to recommend for you guys. This one is from Kevin Aquan. This is the Contour Eyeshadow Palette. And what shade is this? Light? I think it's just light. These are the six shadows that come in it. Very neutral, very wearable. You've got a great highlighter underneath the brow. You've got a great matte crease. And then you've got a couple of shimmer shadows for the lid. And then you have that deeper espresso brown as well to add some depth dimension or smoke out lower lash line. This is a phenomenal travel palette. Really great quality of shadows, really beautiful, very beautiful shades. And I like that there's a mix too. You have kind of like a purpley taupe shade here. You have a warm bronze. Then you have this peach shimmery shade. Let me actually show you guys what they look like. So it's a good mix. It's not, even though they only offer six shades, they kind of got you covered in terms of the range of neutrals. I also want to recommend Jane Aradell. You guys know that I fell in love with this brand this year, and I actually purchased this from Blue Mercury at their last promotion. This is the eyeshadow palette in Storm Chaser, and I want to show you the shades here, and I mentioned this in the first video when I featured this. This wouldn't be a palette that I would pick up. I'd kind of walk by it and think, I don't really know how those colors work together, but you guys, this has created some beautiful, beautiful looks. You've got some warmth and cool in here. You've got shimmer and mattes, high, high quality. Jane Aradell as a whole is just a standout clean beauty brand. Excellent, excellent formulas. So I recommend checking them out if you haven't purchased any Jane Iredell products before. One more Jane Iredell product to share with you and that is the Mineral Pressed Foundation. This is also picked up at the last Blue Mercury event. This is beautiful, great coverage and it doesn't look like a powdered finish. It just really, after it's been on your skin for about 10 or 15 minutes, it really does take a natural look. And you can, depending on how you apply, you can get more coverage. If you wanna use a sponge, you can get like full coverage. If you wanna use a light brush to dust it on, you'll get really sheer coverage. You could layer this over a foundation. If you do that, I would recommend using a large brush so you apply it very light and sheer. Don't go in there and like buff it on top of a liquid foundation because that's kind of like taking liquid foundation, putting it all over the face, then taking another liquid foundation and putting it on top of that. So kind of have that mindset when you do use this over a liquid foundation. And the last product I wanna recommend is the Hourglass Blush Stick in the shade Loyal. It's, this is the Vanish Blush Stick. This is a really beautiful, beautiful formula and particularly this color. Let me show you guys what the color looks like. Just a nice nude peachy, peachy pink. Not too orangey, not too pink, just an easy, don't even think about it, every single day cream blush. Highly pigmented, but it blends out on the skin beautifully. It lasts all day. Really, really beautiful formula. I picked this up at Blue Mercury and I'm actually gonna go back and pick up another shade or two. I really, really like this formula. I do, the component is beautiful, but I can't roll this down. That is the one thing I can't do. I can't roll this down. And so you gotta be careful when you put it in. You gotta be careful when you put it in because I always like, there you go. <laughs> very, very careful hands. 
All right, you guys, that wraps up my haul and my recommendations for the Blue Mercury Holiday Party event. Remember, you can save up to 20% now through December 4th, in-store or online with the code GIFT. If you have the pleasure of stepping into a Blue Mercury store, really enjoy that experience because it really is an experience that you don't get at other beauty stores. You guys know there's other beauty stores that I love to shop about and I talk about, and you know, they're some of my favorites too. But when you actually get to shop in-store at Blue Mercury, you can't really compare it to anything else. It is really, really special. So so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you, Blue Mercury, for partnering with me on this video. I will have every product that I use listed and linked in the description box for you, as well as all the details for the Blue Mercury sale. And I will see you guys in my next video. Have a beautiful day. Bye.